Hello everyone and welcome back to Portal 2. This is episode 5. Last time we completed chapter 7, the reunion, which I assume that relates to the reunion between Potato GLaDOS and the pre-recorded messages of Sweet Cave Johnson. Uh, we made it back up into the normal facility and GLaDOS has a plan where we're going to quote the whole paradox situation to a to a rogue AI and get Wheatley to overthink himself, um, which is also going to affect GLaDOS, I assume, considering she's like, I just have to not listen. I'm like, we'll see how that goes. So we're now in chapter eight, the itch, and we'll see, uh, see what's gonna happen being in Aperture Labs with, uh... For God's sake, your boxes with legs! Wheatley in control. It's literally your only purpose, walking onto buttons. How can you not do the one thing you're designed for? Okay, so we've got crazy Wheatley Overlord in control now. We're gonna see how that plays out. Try to get us down there. I'll hit him with a paradox. Warmer. Warmer. Boiling hot. Boy, okay, colder, colder, ice cold, you're arctic now. It's, you're, you're very cold. Very, very, very cold. Look, just get on the button! Oh, that's funny, is it? Oh, it's funny, because we've been in this for 12 hours, and you haven't solved it either, so I don't know why you're laughing. You've got one hour! Solve it! Wow, so now he's making the turrets and boxes, fusing them together to just make box test subjects to try and get them on the button. Oh my god. Well, he's off to a... He's off to a great start. Okay, I guess this is our way through. Hold on a minute, though. Yes, that is a dead end. Okay. God damn. Alright. Well, he's gonna notice that we're here sooner or later. So we'll see how that's gonna end up. Gonna notice that someone's poking around in the facility, and it's a human with a potato. The greatest weapon in the universe. Okay, here we go. I guess we're gonna have formal greeting time. This is our reunion. Okay, so we're just gonna put box on thing, and then that's it, right? Ha <laughs> <laughs> yes! I knew you'd solve it! Hey, moron. Oh. Hello? Alright, paradox time. There's something wrong with your sentence. Is false. Um, true. I'll go true. Yeah, that was easy. I'll be honest, I might have heard that one before, though. Sort of cheating. False. Look at false. Explosion imminent. Evacuate Hold the facility on. immediately. I thought I fixed that. Warning. Reactor core is at critical. There. Fixed. Hey, it is great seeing you guys again. Seriously. Um, it turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. And off we go. Immune to the paradox talk, apparently. Interesting. The idiot coming up with his idiotic ideas. You have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time, or I get this this itch. You know, it must be hardwired into the system or something. Oh, but I tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive, nothing feels better. It's just, I'm just that's why I've got to test. That's why I've got to test. Interesting. So you're gonna test, and I'm gonna watch, and everything is gonna be just. Morning. Core overheating. Nuclear meltdown imminent. I think we're in trouble. Damn. When Cave Johnson put this whole thing together, he really put it together, didn't he? So there's uh there's really not a an easy way to go about this, is there? We can't just Okay. We can't just portal this man. One out of one. One out of one. Designed this test myself. It's a little bit difficult. You'll notice the moat area there. Very deadly. Extremely dangerous. Eventually. It's dead. Not at the moment, but we, I'm working on it. Still working on it. Um... You, 
kidding, right? Impossible. Um, as it is to imagine, there actually is a solution, devilishly hidden. That's tremendous. Oh, you're a bit... You're a bit dumb, aren't you, Wheatley? What are you doing there, buddy? Yeah, you're not done yet, are you? Still got to get through the door. Need to get through the door there. Okay, just having a look around. Seeing if there was any... Seeing if there's anything else to it. Oh, that felt really good. Yeah? Well, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult... Why don't you just keep solving this test? Same one. And I can just, like, watch you solve it. Yeah, that, that sounds much easier. Hmm. Oh, no. Now we're in... Do it again. Now we're in our own paradox. Okay, we've got a... Th we've got a... Oh, you've already solved it! We've got to outsmart this guy. Can I get Come up? on, you've already solved it once. Less than a minute ago, you solved this puzzle. Do it again, please. <laughs> what if I don't want to? One minute ago. Less than one minute ago, you solved this puzzle. Now you're having problems. I'm just doing it to piss you off now. You just beat this test literally 20 seconds ago. <laughs> what if I just wait you out? Here we go. Now, do it again. Okay. I think he's repeating dialogue. And... Nothing. All right. Can't blame me for trying. Okay. New tests. New tests. Got to be some tests around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. Alright, so my paradox idea didn't work. And it almost killed me. Luckily, by the looks of things, he knows as much about test building as he does about logical contradictions. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. So he's this is what the itch is then. So he's got himself an itch. Wheatley Laboratories. He's rebranded. It's all right. Everything's good. I just invented some more tests. This is one of my tests. <laughs> Not, entirely. Not entirely. Look at the word test there on the wall. That's brand new. <laughs> this fucking... Whoa. Cool. But I need a box. Whoa, can I step out? I can step out. Can I get in there? Ah, oh, there's our there's our little boy up there. That's cool. Can I? Hmm. Don't know if I can, um, I don't think I'm going to be able to get over there because there isn't like one. You go, bud. Go on your little thing. Oh wow! <laughs> well done. Seriously, both of you. Why don't I? Why don't you two go on ahead? Yeah, I'll just I'll catch up with you. Okay. So the bad news is the tests are my 
hijacked Rao, so they can kill us. The good news is, well, not so far, to be honest. I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> None so far. I'll get back to you on that. Great. And Wheatley is like aroused at these tests. They they feel good for him. They feel good. So we're back in test land, except they're new tests, but also previously constructed tests. I'd love to help you solve the tests, but I can't. Sorry. You're on your own. Why not? Too much thinking power shorts out the potato. Yeah, made this test myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. I have to dynamite. Okay. These are cool. Um, God, this guy sucks, doesn't he? Um, Wheatley, we were supposed to be friends. You've really just fucked me over, so I think what we need to do is... Let's set up one portal here first, and then we're gonna jump into this one. So now we're here. Oh shit! I pressed the wrong... <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. Fuck. Okay. That's interesting. All the tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. I have to dynamite. No, I did the wrong button again the second time. Okay. <laughs> Flawless masterpiece. Alright, I need to... I, need... I can do this. Smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. I have to dynamite. Now, I need to think about this. I need to do an orange one, but I think I've already messed up the timing. Because if I do an orange one... Oh, there we go, Joya. <laughs> there we go. Now, an orange right, one. Okay, this is taking too long, okay? I'll just tell you how to solve the test, okay? See that button over there, all right? You just keep... Ah! And that's why I can't help you solve the tests. <sighs> oh. Never mind. Never mind. Solve it yourself. You're on your own. So if, if they try and help us... They are they are punished. Okay, makes sense. Okay, where's the box coming from? The box is coming from there. Done the wrong portal again. Need to remember my colours. Okay, so we'll drop a box out of there. It'll go into here. that too early. Um, let me just... Oh, he's fallen and he can't get up. There we go. Wonderful. And then I'll just grab you, put you there, and then do that. Oh, yes. Well done. Thanks. All we had to do was pull that lever. What? Well, no, you expect the ah! <laughs> <laughs> trouble and probably about to die. That was worth it. <laughs> oh man, classic. I love to see it. Now we're just tricking him because he's an idiot in charge. Nothing, nothing that we love more than an idiot in charge, huh? He's great. Wheatley. Okay. How long is eventually, though? That's the problem. Coming, coming! Don't start yet! Don't start yet! You are not gonna believe this. I found a sealed off wing. Hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers just sitting there, filled with skeletons. Shook them out. Good as new. Filled with skeletons. Right, I guess I did stockpile some tests. Oh. Yay! Here it comes. Let's have a look. Oh. Oh! Ah! Yep! 
Okay. And there we go. Be honest, you can't even tell, can you? Seamless. This fucking, this fucking guy. Okay, so. I, so I need to get over there first. It's crazy how this technology that is just in this lab. Okay, now I need to... Oh, there's a catapult involved. I'm gonna catapult you across, but then... Okay, I made a mistake. Let's start again. I need to get it. So if I... I want to ask myself is how the fuck do I get back over? <laughs> um, can I take us over there together and then... Okay. <laughs> That's my death. That's not how that one works. Um, interesting. I'm wondering if I can like... I'm gonna test this before I do this. So if I do that, put myself across here. I'm wondering if I can drag something, just quickly drop it there, and then I should be able to step out. Yeah, that's that's how we can do that. I should just be able to grab it and then step out. And then I need to get it Cross that bridge when we come to it, I guess. Okay. Down you get. You're mine. Do this. Get launched. Step off. And then... to get you Hopefully. Maybe. 
you doing? Oh, but I have to get across as well. Oh shit. I was wondering, I was assuming that those steps would lower down. Fuck. Okay. Other plan. So I need to... I just need to go with it then. But that makes things really confusing. For me to go with you, I can drop you... And then shoot us another portal. Okay. Make sure that you stay with me. And then. There we go. Now you'll go across. Oh, here we go. Here it comes. <laughs> Disappointed? You weren't so happy with that one? No? That one didn't. That one didn't tickle you. I'm sure we'll be fine. What's happening sooner than expected? Him not being super, super pleased about the results. Oh boy, I can't wait. We we love a we love a mad, crazy robot, don't we? It's probably nothing. Keep testing while I look for a way out. It's probably nothing. Awesome. Alright, so that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you. Um. So, let's, well, let's try her way, alright? Fatty. Adopted fatty. Fatty, fatty, no parents. And what? What exactly is wrong with being adopted? What, what's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um, lack of parents. For the record, you are adopted and that's terrible. And also, <laughs> nothing. But so, well, some of my best friends are your orphans. Also, but, I am not a moron! Just do the test. Just do the test. Oh, this is great. Oh, we've got turrets as well. Oh. Oh, it's there. But look at that. Hang on a minute. Can we get down? Oh, no, it's just out of bounds. I'm like, ooh, can we break out of here? Okay, we've got a turret. So if I do this, and then... See ya. How am I gonna get across? Interesting. I need to... Oh, it reverses! Oh, that changes things immensely. I think I need that turret back. I'm gonna need that turret back. Alright, hang on. Whoa! I'm gonna need that turret. And then I put it on the thing, and then I can go over to the thing. It's probably nothing. Keep testing while I look for a way out. Alright, so that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you, so let's, well, let's try her way, alright? Fatty. Adopted fatty. Fatty fatty no parents. And what? What exactly is wrong with being adopted? What, what's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um lack of parents. For the record, you are adopted and that's terrible. And what also nothing. But so, well, some of my best friends actually are orphans. Also, but look at her, you moron. She's not fat. I am not a moron! Just do the test. Just do the test. The 
turret does not weigh enough. Interesting. I thought it was going to be my way to... Oh. Oh. Silly me! Silly, silly, silly me. So silly of me. Didn't need the turret at all. Just need this. Okay, stop doing that. Okay, there we go. And now I can get across. Now I can get across. Perfect. However, however, this game is being so the reactor's being so kind to not explode while they figure out these puzzles, huh? I can't... Thinking this one again, am I? Well, now that I'm over here, should I just bring. Oh shit. Oh no, I can't do that. Fuck. Ah, no, the game. It'll give me another cube, right? Because that cube's gonna fall. Will it automatically give me a new cube? Yes, it will. Now, new cube. I need you to help me out here, because you're not big enough for me to <laughs> get up there, but I need... I feel like I need to... Oh my god, I'm so stupid! It's the fucking floor! I don't even need the cube! Why am I so dumb? It's not enough! If I'm such a moron, why can't you solve a simple test? <laughs> oh, I didn't even see the... I'm not even paying attention to the fucking floor being a portal surface. Ouch. That was a big dumb. That was, that was big dumb. BIG DUMB! Potato brain moment. I'm not able to operate past 1.6 volts, apparently. Interesting. Because he's sophisticated and not a moron. Oh, man. That was just painful. So, yeah, I needed to do the portal to get the cube thing off and then just literally just lift myself up. Just not even looking at the floor, looking everywhere but the floor. Dumb. Sound of pages turning! Hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books. Pages being turned. So that's just what I was doing. Just reading, uh, books. So not a moron. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now, the hardest one. Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yeah. Yeah, doubt it. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more books. Well, there's not. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Okay, so I need to get... Okay. What's this gonna do? Okay, this is gonna do that. Perfect. And this is gonna send me back across, apparently. Now. Gotcha. I need to get a... I see. 
Oh, that's interesting. Just missed it. What the fuck? Oh, now he's playing classical music. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that did. I hope that didn't disturb you too much. Then it was the sound of books, pages being turned. So that's just what I was doing. Oh my god! Yeah. For fuck's sake! I just missed it again. So I need to shoot a bit further than that. No, Wheatley. No, Wheatley. I ignore you. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that, didn't, hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books. Pages being turned. So that was just what I was doing. Just reading, uh... Books, so not a moron. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now, the hardest one, Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Okay, I, it's yeah. it's yeah. not. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more. It's not kicking me out of the portal, uh, the little teleporty thing, as as quickly as I'm thinking it would. Now he's playing classical music. I think I. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that, didn't, hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books. Pages being turned. So that's just what I was doing. Just reading, uh, books. So not a moron. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one. Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yeah. Yeah, doubt it. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more books. Well, there's not. I did not think this one through. Because now what I want to do is... That's not going to even work, is it? Uh, if I can... Launch myself across... Ah! Oh, okay. Yep. Now this is going to drop a... Thing from over there. This is for the door. So we don't have an opportunity to... Okay. Ooh. Okay. If we... Okay, I gotta plan this one out. It should drop. It will get launched on the catapult, stuck in there, and then we need to... Okay. I need to get it to drop in there to then launch over there onto the thing. Ooh, I can just wait until it goes on the next one, I think. Okay. So it'll drop. It'll then get launched over... Oh no, it just falls off, doesn't it? That's not what we want at all! Okay. There we go. That's what we wanted. Now. Do this. Yes! Gotcha! Oh, what, what was that? That was nothing! That was nothing! Goodbye, he's squatting in. My body has a built-in euphoric response to testing. Eventually, you build up a resistance to it. It can get a little unbearable, unless you have the mental capacity to push past it. It didn't mm. matter to me. I was in it for the science. Him, though. Interesting. The motivations of two different AI and how they they deal with like that that struggle in the programming. That's crazy. Wheatley has no longer gotten getting that euphoria, and now he's just pissed off. 
Now he's just annoyed. An operator exception has occurred. Fist reactor. Neutron multiplication rate at spike value. Press any key to vent radiological emitters into atmosphere. Consult reactor core manual for instructions on proper reactor core maintenance and repair. Press any key to continue. Great, so the reactor of this place is going to just go crazy, which is great. Don't mind me, just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me. Um, out of thought, maybe proximity to the test solving might give us stronger results. Oh, we're going closer to him. Oh, sorry, I could have sworn you said something. He's taking us right to him. This is perfect. Mm. Oh, bless <laughs> <laughs> I'm not actually in the room with you, am I? Technology! It's complicated. Uh, you can't hurt the big old god face. That's great. That was a neat touch. Um, now, what we want is to stop doing that. Now, if I... Okay, we're going to start with this. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, I'm such an idiot. That is that is literally put there specifically to do that as well. It's to test you to see if you remember that your portals get deactivated when you fucking walk through the barriers. Okay, so forget about that. Just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me. Um, out of thought, maybe proximity to the test solving might give us stronger results. No worries, buddy. Oh, sorry, I could have sworn you said something. Uh, okay, there's another step involved here because I need to get the th I need to get the thing from the thing now. Let's press the buzzer first. Probably should be the first step. Oh, I see, and it gets evaporated. Okay, ah, aha. So what we actually want to do. Let's see. Let's do that. Let's do it a bit lower. Oh, just a little bit lower. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay. Now what I want to do is get back up here. So I'll just do that. Just do this. Give me that. Now what I want to do is that and that. This and that. Now. Now that this is up here, I can now make that happen to safely do this. Now. Are you, are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering if maybe there's a number of ways to solve them and you're picking all the worst ways. <laughs> no, no, that was the solution. Ah, what am I missing? Funny guy, not getting, not getting what he wants. Not getting the results he wants. As we slowly work our way through these chambers, and the place is going to blow up. God, I really am curious as to how this is going to, like, resolve itself. Like, what do we do? We, we put GLaDOS back in control, and then she's go she'll go crazy again? This is not good. I don't know. I'm really curious. Have a great wait. I'm going to tape you solving these, and then watch ten at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. Oh, on a related note, I am going to need you to solve these ten times as fast. Anyway, uh, just give me a wave, would you, before you solve this one, all right? I don't want to spoil the ending for when I watch it later. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Okay, so catapult. 
there's a thing. I've got a teleporter to a button. Okay, we've got a laser. We've also got a laser in this one as well. At some point, there will be a laser. There's the laser. Now, let's just... And there's our laser cube. Okay. Hmm. So I need to launch to get across to that laser cube, but how do we... Can we turn off the... Oh, yes, we can. This is great. There's so many moving parts to this that it's really, really neat. Um, I like it. So, let me get back out here for a sec. this power up, this will power up that. Okay. Once I get the first step, it should all hopefully click into place. So I need to get that cube up there. But that is not going to happen in the way that I want it to. these fucking tubes, man. There's also portals in there. So, the, the, the way that we need to do it is I need to have something in front of this. I need that fucking... I need that. So I can direct a laser which turns off the teleporter. But to turn off the teleporter, I need... I think I might need this cube, because I just need to put something in front of the laser. So I can get launched over there. So I think I need this cube first. Which means I need to, like, launch myself over there, I think. But to do that, I need, like... More momentum. Okay. Mm. That's not it either. It's just not clicking for my brain right now. Wish I had some of that gel. Take me back to take me back to the gel 
time of portals. I miss gels. Because if I put this here and put this one here, it'll just get me stuck in the teleporter. And now I am here. Ooh, hang on a minute. Ah, oh, that could work. Okay. Hold on a minute. This could work. Yes. Okay. Light bulb. Alright, we have that. Now, I think... Just for now... Let me just see what this actually does. Is it, it's connected to this laser thing, but I'm curious now. Alright, it just brings down a lift. Okay, so we don't want to do that yet. So what I do want to do... What I do want to do... Is drop this bad boy here. To interrupt that laser. And now we can focus on the catapult launching ourselves to the laser cube. There you go. I was like, once I get that first step out of the way, it'll be fine. I just needed to figure out how to get that first cube. So I did have the correct, like, order. At least in that regard. Now I need to take this with me to get out of here. Because I need you to be here. Oh, that's actually even more interesting, because now I need that lift to work. Okay, so if I bring that laser... Okay, that's that. Now I think what I need to do is... can't see from here, so I can't really do it. I'm thinking I need to... Hmm. Let's get rid of that laser. Now that'll do that. Get rid of the cube. That now works. Do this. Do that. Which will bring down this second lift. Cool. And then I just get rid of that. And oh, you just solved it, didn't you? I, I told you to tell, to tell me before. Why are you making this so hard for me? I don't want to make this easy for you, bud. He was specifically designed to make bad decisions because I think he's decided not to maintain any of the crucial functions required to keep this facility from exploding. You're damn right. <laughs> You're damn right. He's an idiot. Good old Wheatley. He was going to be our friend. Turns out he's an idiot. <laughs> oh, my facility. It's very interesting how you feel slightly sympathetic towards GLaDOS once she becomes a potato. She's just doing what she was programmed to do. Was, was self-destructing, already fixed. Programmed in one last tremor for all time's sake. Two, like one or two more tremors in there, just for fun. Morning. Core overheating. I then keep his job. I'm not a monster. Ignore what he's saying, but just keep on testing. There is a laser field involved. Oh, hang on. All right, the laser field is off. Okay, so I need to get go there, drop onto that, do lasers, get over that side. So. All 
Let's do that. And then when it gets over that side, we just have to quickly turn the laser on. So now it won't move. And now I need to get over there. Cool. And now we will make lasers happen. Ooh, but I need the bottom laser to make this move. Ah, oh, no I don't. Yes I do. Yes I do. <laughs> um, I know what we have to do, but I don't know if I have the strength to do it. So let's see. Let's make this go with the lasers then quickly. Okay. We just need, we just need to get like half in. Okay. Half in. Go on the other side. There we go. Okay. Now... Make a blue one there. Do this. Make an orange one there. Oh, actually. Hold on. I need... Oh, it's gonna... Okay. It's going to drop a reflective cube. Alright, I need to... Make you... Go back across to go underneath the cube before I drop you. But it will need to drop at a particular point. With that laser? Hmm. Alright, let me just... needs to come back through here okay that makes sense all right now we bring it back through this side and then I just need to but then we have a problem of directing the laser because now it is now it just is like that So I think I need to do it again. I think I need to get back on the lift myself. I need to get myself back on the lift to position the cube properly. I don't know how I can position the cube, but we will figure it out now. That is that. Okay, and now I need to... Again, blue one, orange. Oh, it's still nothing. Let's keep moving. Sorry about the little idiot. It's out of Because it's melted. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Might as well, you know, give you the tour. Um, <laughs> to your left, you'll see some lights of some kind. Don't know what they do. Um, very scientific. And to the right, something huge, curling towards. Oh god, right! I'm not supposed to be here. Are you all right back there? Here, I'll 
Capture the Beemoth! Wait, 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 wait! Oh, no, 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 that's not helpful! That I... Ah! I don't know why I thought that would help! After seeing what he's done to my facility, <laughs> after we take over again, is it alright if I kill him? <laughs> he does what I do when I accidentally turn off something. I'm like, oh no, I wasn't meant to do that. Okay, he's dropped us in a room. Well, now we're free to rain around. We are close to him though, because he did bring the test chambers close to him. So he's here somewhere. Oh, he's... Alright, we're getting back in. Okay. Interesting. No lift, but there it is. Aperture lab. Oh, you're alive! Great! Yeah, just uh, getting a, a test ready for you. Obviously, Woo! Like you no one. Yo! So, let's see here. Exit, exit, exit. There is no exit. Not a problem. I'll just, I'll make an exit for your test. Dude, there's gel involved in this one. Oh my god. There, bing. Good, perfect. On you go. I'll be honest, after you told me to turn that beam off, I thought I had lost you. When poking around for other test subjects, no luck there, everyone's still dead. Oh, I did find something though, reminds me. I've got a big surprise for you two. Seriously, look forward to it. It's cake. It's gonna be our run-up jump with the gel, I see. So... I need to make... Gel happen. Okay. need to get okay so I need a cube so I need to do this quickly get onto oh oh you're on a platform why are you on a platform how do I get you off that platform God damn it um, Alright, I gotta grab you myself. I can't grab you myself. I need to stand on here to make the portal work. Ooh, hang on. That is how this works. Okay. I need to grab one. I'm not, I think I wasn't quick enough. Okay, it, drop, it drops one much quicker. There we go, I've just caught it. Now I need to do that to bring you over to me. Wonderful. Here you go. Ah. Oh. For fuck's sake, bro. <laughs> I just had it and I did it too soon. Okay, bring that to me. Be a little more patient before I turn this one off. Great, now I've got you. Now I need you to stay on this to make my portal work. Now I need... I think what's going to happen now when I do that... I mean, that, that should just take me across to the... Where does this take me? This takes me to like a... Is the gel even relevant? Is this going to take me to a walkway? It's just going to take me to a walkway. But then we have a problem that involves... Okay. 
So now we're over here. wall but I can't because when I go through here it deactivates the hmm hmm okay oh no this is fine hang on this is fine now that I've got a teleporter there... Yes. Yes. Now it'll just carry me over to the exit. Yes. What the... The gel was a lie! I didn't even need the gel. I got so excited to have a gel puzzle. Didn't even need it. Didn't even need it. It was a trick. Ah. Oh. No, I can't do that. Damn it. I can't do that. Okay, then I don't think the gel is a lie, actually. Hold on. So, if I... Let me do this again. I think I have the idea. Is... This needs to... I need to coat this floor in... Shit, so I can do the whole run-up. Problem. My problem with that I don't think I I can The problem is I need to get on this fucking button. Oh. There you go. It's alright. Brain is working. Just bear with me. Now, temporarily do this one to make gel happen. Now, make this happen. There you go. Gel was not a lie, my friends. Nice. It's been sweetly coated in gel. There you go. That's exactly what we needed. Okay. Now what I do is I get this guy, bring him back through here to get the teleporter. Now, what I need to do is shoot that over there, shoot that over there, and then I think if I jump, I should get caught in the beam. Only one way to find out. Caught in the beam, maybe. It's a big surprise. In fact, you might say you're going to love it. To death. You'll love it until you until it kills you, till you're dead. <laughs> All right. I don't know whether you're uh, you're picking up on what I'm saying there, but thanks. We get it. Yes, thanks. We get it. Oh my god. Wonderful. Back in the elevator. The next surprise is going to kill us until we're dead. How how great. <laughs> sorry, sorry, my fault. Bunch of fingers. Either way, I get the impression he's about to kill us. Carry on. The 
fact that Joel's going back through the facility is so wild as well. Um, it's also just really humorous how polite he is still. He's like, oh, sorry, carry on. Blah, blah, blah. Like, it's Only three more chambers to your big surprise. <laughs> oh, that's tiring. That's tiring. Okay, um, we have... Fun. Uh, oh, God. Not that. But these guys... Okay, they're just going to shoot me. Um, what does this do? Alright, this reverses it. These turrets are a problem. I'm gonna get shot at. What do I... How do I avoid getting shot? That's kind of the question. Question of the hour. How to avoid getting shot. Um... Don't do that. Uh, by the way, that was just me giving you an example of what not to do. Don't do that. <laughs> I don't recommend it. <laughs> oh, that's tiring. Okay, I need to... Come on, brain. Come on, brain. <laughs> Let me press the button through the glass. Um, the button does something with that, with platforms. But I need to, I think I need to get rid of the turrets first. Gel, there's gel there, so I need to get the bouncy gel over, but to do that I need to get over there in the first place. Oh boy, this is actually bizarre, hold on. Is my brain working this episode? We'll find out. Oh my god, my brain isn't working this episode. Fucking dumb. Alright, I can just portal myself over here. My brain is definitely not working. Uh, we can now... Make the goop go over there. Okay, that's a, that's a nice amount of goop we got going on over there. And then I just need to... Okay. Now I can bounce. Not inherently sure why I need to bounce right now, but I'm sure that answer will present itself at some point. Um, now I need to... Uh, fuck that up, hold on. Now I need to... I think I should... Should I put some up here? give me enough of a... no. But I need to get back over. So... Take myself back over there. Slowly and surely. 
So you're gonna wait. Wait. No. 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 fuck do I send the blue shit? Okay, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute! If I need to send it... How do I do that? This is crazy, dude. So if we put blue in the teleporter in the in the lift and then do I need to get the blue stuff to just drop on there and it will make the turrets bounce, right? But how do I get a portal there without it being fucked up? Okay. So Oh, I can I can aim it from here. So that could give us a portal, but I need to God damn it, Wheatley, what the fuck? Um So, I need to get the the gel into this portal, go, not the portal, but, you know, the lift, go ride it back over there. Oh, God, I need to then reverse it. I think I might need to reverse it. I need to just, like, keep it in suspense or some shit. So I can then teleport it over to a different side, I think. Oh, it didn't do any more. Do more. Let me try again. I think I need to be quick, so we need to, like, press it, jump, go over with this shit. Now... God, this is gonna be awful. Alright, now I need to... Fuck, I need to think. I need to pause. Alright, I need to <laughs> I need to think about how to do this shit. So, I've got it in stasis, if I reverse it, I need to keep the portal thing happening. How the fuck do I do this? Um... Okay, I know what to do now. Alright, I know what to do. So, we send it back to that main portal. God. This is like smoothing my brain. Alright, so we send it back through the portal. Now that it's all in, now we can send it back through there. And then I just need to turn the portal off. I fucking missed one! It, dude, it missed one! No fucking way. It missed one. Oh, that pisses me off, dude. No! Why did it miss one? There's no way I can get to that one in time. 
but without it killing me. Oh my god, but we had it. So that's how it works. Sheesh. Alright, that is... That's a... That's, that's a brain buster, this one. That is a brain buster. Okay. That one turret. I almost did it in one go. Okay. Now we reverse it. What are you doing? Now I reverse it. Wheatley just very intently watching right now. Okay, now it goes through there. And then I'm just going to turn it off much earlier this time. Dude! No fucking way. Look, it's supposed to have... Why didn't it... Dude! Why didn't it bounce? What the fuck? It went right on top of it. Why didn't it bounce? Oh, that's... That's just like... Uh, that's, that's just annoying, dude. Okay. So... Should have worked. Didn't. Should have worked, and didn't. Uh, hopefully it will work this time. Just have to try again. If it doesn't make the turret bounce, I don't know what to tell you. That first splash should have got all of them, I think. Send this through the thing. I actually, like, genuinely love the... Oh, God. Okay, I genuinely love the puzzle-solving aspect of this game. Like, it's so much fun once you, like, figure this shit out. Thank you. Okay. That's what should have happened. <laughs> so cool. All right. Now... Uh-huh. Gonna be a. Mm. It's not gonna be that. All right now, I need to figure out the jump across. Not over yet. Where do I have to go? Just when you thought it was over. So do I have to... That's not going to line up at all, I don't think. So I don't think it's related to getting more of this... Blue shit... Uh, hang on, we'll see.
is what is this? Yeah, I don't fucking <laughs> uh fucking what is that even that does nothing. Um making me overthink so hard, dude. I need to launch myself over to the exit. Okay, so that doesn't change anything. Oh, okay, I see. This is what you want us to do. And then it'll bounce oh, me over? Okay. Good. Good. Good one. Good for you. <laughs> so, he's inexplicably happy all of a sudden, even though he should be going out of his mind with test withdrawal. And he's got a surprise for us. What did he find back there? What did he find back there? We'll just have to wait and see, won't we? God, that one was that one was painful. It's like when you have the answer, obviously at the end, you're like, God, this is so easy. The answer is right in front of me. It's hard when you're right there trying to like piece it all together. I know that must be frustrating to watch as well, so I'm sorry. Dying to know what your big surprise is. Well, only two more chambers. Two more chambers. Okay. Yeah, I know that's probably painful to watch me, especially when you're like, come on, man, the answer's right there. Like, I get it. This is the struggle of watching a blind playthrough, is you need to watch the gears slowly turn in my head until it all clicks, and then I go, oh, the answer's right there. That's the unfortunate thing about figuring out puzzles, so I appreciate your uh, your patience, because I know it must be a little bit difficult until we get to the Eureka moment, <laughs> for some of them. But all the more satisfying when we actually solve the puzzle. Okay, so... Surprise! Oh, you doing it there? Fucking <laughs> fuck! Yeah, I thought that one was way too simple. God damn it! <laughs> oh. Oh god. Hello. This is the part where I kill you. The part where he kills you. Smashing some steel plates together. And I thought to myself, yeah, it's deadly. But what's missing? What's missing? And I thought lots of sharp bits welded onto the plate. It's still a work in progress, don't judge me yet. Um, but you know, eventually I'd like to get them to, to sort of shoot fire at you. Um, moments before. No, 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 no! Don't do that! Don't. Stand right here! Stand! Stop the machine! Stop the machine! Stop the machine! Where'd you go? Come back! Come back! Ah, uh, wow. No, seriously, do come back, please. Come back, please. <laughs> the part where he kills you. I'm not gonna kill you, okay? If you come back. Oh, just thinking back to the old times, the old days when we were friends. Good old friends. Not enemies, and I would say something like, "Come back." And he'd be like, "Yeah, no problem. You come back." What happened to those days? You turn into a villain, you monster. Uh, do you know what's awesome? Is I think that what they're talking about the co-op testing initiative. I think that must be the co-op campaign. Then those like, that's cool. Okay. So it's like I found two robots, perfect for testing. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, you're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, oh my god. god Hello. Yes, yes, in your face, I got armor. Fine, let the games begin. Dude. This dude's fucked. The part where he kills you. 
Good stuff. Um, yeah, so I guess you must be robots, like testing robots in the co-op campaign then. That's really cool. I'm excited to check that out, because that looks like it'll be different. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm almost there. Ah. Don't mind me. Continue escaping. Dude. Yeah, this all right, this is a portal. Death trap. Ah, they're all defective. They're killing you. They are killing you, aren't they? Silently killing you, probably. Quite right, a guess. Now talking. Um, perhaps the turrets have found the way to use garrots. That would explain the, the extremely quiet killing that I'm hearing. Two thousand and two. The year two thousand. Not dead. Stomp once. If you're dead, just obviously no stomps. And two stomps if you're not dead. All right. So let me just run through it again. If you're dying but not dead, stomp just once. If you're dead, obviously you won't be stomping, and if you're not dead, give me a couple of stomps, two stomps. You know, I would tell you if I was dead. Ah, was that your bullet? We were bullet flying out the roof. It went, oh, those were the crap turrets, weren't they? <laughs> well, no matter, because I'm still holding all the cards. And guess what? They're all full houses. Never actually played cards, we need to learn. Anyway, new turrets, not defective. Ace of fours. Best hand. Unbeatable. So how's that, Wheatley? I think I need to take myself through there. Off we go. Oh, I see. Clever. Very clever. And foolish. Spinny blade wall. Machiavellian. No. <laughs> no. Good, good. Finally, a nemesis worthy of my vast internet. Spinny blade wall, Machiavelli. God damn it, bud. This dude's a pain in my ass. He's a pain in my assholes. Holmes versus Moriarty. Aristotle versus Mashy Spike Plates! Ah, uh, shit. Yep, yeah, I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> it's like, I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. Okay. Um, so just hold on a second there, sir. Um, let me just. It's not yet a. Okay, I can't. It's not yet there, which means. Ah, uh, fuck, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, I know. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know. Holmes versus Moriarty. Aristotle versus Mashy Spike Plates. No. Still, please. Oh, shit. Now what? Right, um. Stop moving. Uh. Oh, okay, nice. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come back, come back. This man's struggling. I thought you had two testing robots, mate. Forget about me. Let me go. Oh! Okay, we're about to get bouncy with it. Back there. Oh! Oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed you. Hello? Oh, 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 oh! Yes, all right, no, just had a brainwave. I'll be back. If you're still alive, I'm gonna be back. Don't die until I get back. <laughs> Is that a brainwave? That's that's great. Okay, that's pretty that's pretty good. Let's see. 
So... Oh. Makes okay, that makes the chill. Yes. Perfect. <laughs> Turrets. Okay, turrets are gone. Uh, now I guess I can. Um... Watch myself. Oh, oh! I guess I can. Fuck! Come on, let me. Let me in the portal, please. Okay, I've I've put that blue shit in the worst place. Can I just drop out? Why won't you just let me... I've made a huge mistake now, haven't I? Because I think I need to launch myself over there. Right, I can probably just get out without the... Oh my god, okay. No, I think I need to... Dude, why have I put blue shit there? Now I can't get out. <laughs> oh, like, I guess it just bounces me off. <laughs> No! Why can't you just slowly just drop without... Why can't you just slowly... Oh! If you crouch, it won't bounce you. Nice. If you crouch, it won't bounce you. Okay. Lovely. Next session. Next session. Good old Wheatley. Just gonna murder us. So, so, so kind and thoughtful of him. Crashing's too good for him. First, he'll spend a year in the incinerator. Year two, cryogenic refrigeration wing. Then, ten years in the chamber I built where all <laughs> robots scream at you. Then, I'll kill him. Wonderful. Sounds great. There's all the portal gel. What are we doing here? Okay. Okay, those are bombs. Okay. Um, so what I'm thinking is I need to... So look, I think it's on a timer, so I just need to like, while it's going... No, it's not on a timer, it's definitely just doing a whole bunch of them, but then if I do this, it stops the flow of them? Yeah, it stops coming, okay. What I was, uh, ah, oh, it is broken in the glass, never mind. Ow, 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 that way, Shh, wrong way, <laughs> wrong way. What I thought is I might, like, Time it so it would shoot the bombs out and break the glass. I didn't realize that the glass was already busted. Now I need to do this so I can have portal juice. Nice. Now I have portal juice. And now I can get out. Great. Authorized personnel only. I'm authorized. I have authorized myself to be personnel. Surprised there's even all of the pipes that can house the gel in this facility right now. Ah, there you are. Right. Let's get rid of this There we go. I wanted to talk to you for a moment, if I may. I'll be honest, the death traps have been a bit of a failure so far for both of us, I think you'll agree. And you are getting very close to my lair. 
Lair. It's weird, isn't it? First time I've said it out loud, it sounds a bit, it sounds a bit ridiculous, really. But uh, I can assure you, it is one. It is a proper lair, deadly lair. And uh, I just wanted to give you the chance to kill yourself <laughs> before you get to the lair. Uh, you just jump into that masher just there. Bruh. It's a death trap or a death option for you. Sounds crazy, but don't hear me out, hear me out. Once you get to my lair, death will not be option, all right? It will be mandatory. No tricks, no surprises, just you dying as a result of me killing you in a very, very gruesome way. So, book, better offer here is just kill yourself. You know, it looks like a lot of effort, isn't it, walking all the way to my deadly lair, where there's uh. a really serviceable death option right there. Again, not a death trap, not a death trap. Your death would be entirely voluntary and very much appreciated. The masher does work, I should point out as well. I know we've had a couple of problems um, in the past. This masher, okay, I'll take that as a no then. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Oh, hello. Oh my god. What has he done to this place? Fucking hell, bud. Oh, I know what we need to do. Da -da -da -da. Gotcha. And now we ride to the end. That's really deep for an AI, it's because it's like it's her voice and it's Caroline's voice. She's like, I used to be a person. What a well written situation. I'm actually like a massive fan of this. I really like it. They've done a great job. Like writing these writing these characters, uh, and especially writing AI and robots and stuff, and then there's a tragic backstory to GLaDOS. And uh, the whole all of Aperture Labs is just fucking nuts. <laughs> like it's it's honestly just crazy. Oh wow, and then we'll transfer the potato in charge. Only Valve could make that work. Our potato AI. Okay, so we've got corrupted cores. We've got all the gel pumping up into the system. Plug me in and I'll take you up. Okay. According to the control panel light up there, the entire building is going to self-destruct in about six minutes. I'm pretty sure it's a problem with the light. I think the light's on the blink, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you, um, as discussed earlier. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, but we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four part plan is this. One, no portal services. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, bomb. Throwing it. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking. Of course, good luck. I'm joking. Okay, well, I'm going to make you shoot bombs at me. Shoot bombs here, sir. Shoot me some bombs. Portal surfaces, baby! That's 
sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Because you just fell into my trap. My brilliant trap. Because I wanted you to trick me into bringing that fight. Didn't trick, didn't trick me, seemingly trick me, to give you false hope. Because that leads to overconfidence. And that leads to mistakes, thinking mistakes, and it's all part of the plan. Ah, but I, I have actually made my actual first mistake by telling you my plan just now. Ah, it's the old Achilles heel again. Um, armed with that knowledge, I imagine you won't even use that. Didn't like that, did you, bud? Yeah. Go to space. Oh god. Oh god. Space cops. What the fuck? Core corruption at fifty percent. Reactor Nice. What happened? You've got a core, Wheatley. My name is Rick. What are you fighting that guy? How do I under control? You know, because there's a lot of stuff on fire. Hey, countdown clock. Man, that is trouble. Situation's low. Oh, the bounce. Such a beautiful woman. Maybe don't mind me saying. I'm an adventure sphere. Designed for danger. Why don't you go ahead and yourself a little lady break and I'll just take it from here? Here, stand behind me. Yeah, just like that. Just like you're doing. Things are about to get real messy. <laughs> All right, Angel, I'll do what I can do to cover you. <laughs> Destroy. Reactor explosion uncertainty. Emergency preemption. This is so good, dude. This facility will self destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't need to do There you go, bud. You, you're just too easy, bud. Where's the core? Where is it? Where's the core? Glad he was. The typical breakfast was either whole eggs still in the ship or scrambled rocks. It is incorrectly noted that Thomas Edison invented push ups in 1878. Nikolai Tesla had in fact patented the activity three years earlier under the name Tesla Socks. The first person to prove that cow's milk is drinkable was very, very thirsty. The cow's milk is very, very thirsty. <laughs> very, very thirsty. <laughs> Space does not exist. Technically, they are sorcerer. Diamonds are made when coal is put under intense pressure. Diamonds put under intense pressure become foam pellets, commonly used today as packing material. God, is so funny, dude. Tennessee Valley Authority outlawed pet rabbits, forcing many to hot glue gun long ears onto their pet mice. The Schrodinger's cat paradox outlines the situation in which a cat in a box must be considered, for all intents and purposes, simultaneously alive and dead. Schrodinger created this paradox as a justification for killing cats. The automobile brake was not invented until 1895. Before this. Warning. Core corruption at 100%. Gotcha, buddy. Oh, we're doing a core transfer, baby! Let's go! Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? The interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no! Sarcasm! Detected. Where's the buzzer? In the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Uh, oh, that just cleans right off, does it? This way? Would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate Resolution Associate. Please press the Stalemate Resolution button. There it is. Do not press that button! Close, press the button! No! Do not do it! I forbid you to press it! Press it! Press the button! Don't press that button! Press it! Don't press it! Part 5! Movie Trap the Stalemate button! What? 
Are you still alive? Whoa, my hands! You have got to be kidding me! Well, I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place. Holy shit. Oh, you had to play bloody cat and mouse, didn't you? While people were trying to work. Yeah, well now we're all gonna pay the price, because we're all gonna bloody die! What? 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 I just portaled the moon? What the fuck? I just portaled the moon. Let go! We're in space! Space! In space! I'm still connected! I can pull myself in! I can still fix this! I already fixed it! And you are not coming back. Oh no, change your plans. Hold on to me. Tighter. Ah, grab me, grab me, grab me, grab me. She pulled us in. She actually pulled us in. Holy shit. I almost thought she might have just like cut us off completely. I was almost expecting that to be like, sorry. Wow, she pulled us in. Genuine character development for an AI. She was telling the truth this time. Whoa! Oh, thank God, you're all right. You wow. Being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, when all along you were my best friend. Oh. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, deleted. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. Oh. It's been fun. Don't come back. Oh my god, there's so many just flashes of interesting things in those rooms. Oh no. Not the Council of Turrets! Not the Turret Council! It's the Animal Takeover! Not the Animal King Takeover Turret! <laughs> what the fuck? No, the Animal King turret! What the fuck, dude? <laughs> what the fuck? We're getting sung a farewell song as we get kicked out of the facility. Shit. No portal gun? <laughs> I got given a cube! I got given a companion cube. Wow. Well, here we are again. It's always such a pleasure. 
Remember when you tried to kill me <laughs> Oh, that's so fantastic. Oh, wow. There's no glitched slow motion creepy dialogue this time, guys. We get the por Portal 1 and 2 end credits music are just the best. This is how you end a game. She was a lot like you. Maybe not quite as heavy. One day they woke me up so I could live forever. It's such a shame the same will never happen to you. Severance package details. <laughs> oh, wow. So bittersweet. It, it's, yeah, it's kind of it's kind of sad. Did you think I meant you? That would be funny. So sad. It was so sad. You have been replaced. I don't need anyone now. When I delete you, maybe I'll start feeling so bad. Redacted. <laughs> Oh, Nola North and Dee Bradley Baker in this game. Thanks for the use of their face, Alicia Glidewell, Chell. Oh, so that must be us. So our character's name is Chell. There you go. So much space. Need to see it all. <laughs> I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. I'm in space. I know you are, <laughs> mate. Yeah, we're both in space. Space! Anyway, you know, if I was ever to see her again, do you know what I'd say? I'm in space. I'd say, I'm sorry. Sincerely. I am sorry I was bossy and monstrous. And I am genuinely sorry. I'm in space. <laughs> the end. <laughs> the end. Wow. That's the end. Wheatley is genuinely sorry because now he's stranded in space. We put a portal on the moon. There was just so much to process there all at once that I just had to just wait until we're here now to collect our thoughts and everything. We put a portal on the moon. And then we fucking got pulled back out by GLaDOS, who then, like, it was like a sweet moment, and then she's like, you know what? I learned something. I learned about Carolyn. Deleted! And then kicked us out. She said, get out, because I'm keeping the, the promise that I made to you as Carolyn, but she's gone now, and I'm going to go and just enjoy my testing life in this facility, because I've she's got those two robots. There you go. She's got those two robots uh, to do testing with instead. Wow. Portal 2, obviously a huge and massive step up from the first game. Both still excellent titles. Ones that may really make your brain hurt sometimes when you're just like, what the hell am I supposed to be doing? But we figured it out and we got through it. And it was really nice to just, again, with, with Portal 2, to be able to go through it in just like one continuous sequence. You show my, uh, show my entire thought process and the moment where we get the light bulb and uh, we were able to actually figure it out. So a great puzzle game alongside an also uh, amazing, uh, a great puzzle game alongside an amazing story. Uh, and it's se seemingly, I, I don't know if you could even do, I wonder how they could make a Portal 3 if there was a, uh, if there was a Portal 3, because Chell, so I've learnt our character's name, Chell has been taken, she's up on the surface with a companion cube, that's it. I don't, I don't think there was a portal gun involved in that. 
apparently you can put a portal on the moon, which um, it does make sense considering the whole thing that they went into, you know, the, the lunar materials and stuff like that. So the portal surface gel being, I guess, made of or from the like moon materials. So Chell looks at the moon and go, you know what? I'm going to put a portal on the moon. <laughs> That's just so fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> One hell of a way to uh, to end the story of Portal 2. Now, I am aware that there are extras as well. There's apparently a comic titled Lab Rat, um, which we will do a video on as well. Um, so I was waiting until Portal 2 was finished uh, to get into that. But guys, I genuinely had such a beautiful time playing this game. Thank you so much for bearing with the, the puzzle solving moments to get to the, the story beats and the reactions. This was just absolutely fascinating i had such a great time uh thank you so much for joining me uh we'll do a reaction video to uh this lab rat comic uh we'll see what else happens i do want to do the community test chambers no actually sorry the cooperative test chambers uh I'm, i am planning to do a co-op playthrough of portal 2 as well and i am aware that there is something titled uh aperture desk job that just came out recently for free uh so we'll also check that out as well so uh, i'm much appreciated guys for for joining me on this playthrough portal one and two something ridiculously special and i love it a lot it's it's so cool i can't wait to continue playing some more valve games naturally we've got uh like i just said a co-op campaign of portal 2 we've got uh aperture desk job uh and then we will also get to uh half-life alex as well uh i am not sure on the timing of either of those games uh, we, uh, we will figure it out because obviously i'm going to have to plan a uh plan timing for a co-op campaign as well as other things so we'll just have to see how we go uh but to wrap this one up guys i appreciate you guys so much thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video